Shout it out loud, sing with the crowd, celebrate cause Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be about my 2015 year in review and also my goals and expectations of the year 2016. So if you want to see that, now. Okay, 2015 has been a really, really interesting year for me. There, there have been some highs and lows, but I'm glad to say there were more highs than lows. The first high for me in 2015 was the fact that I became a YouTuber. So now I'm able to capture some moments of my life and share it with you guys all around the world. The second high in 2015 for me was the fact I was able to launch two of my books all in that same year. The first one, the second book I launched was, was launched in February, February 2015. That was called The Big School. And the last one recently was in November 2015 and that was Just Say It. That's, that's a tremendous high for me. Third high for me in 2015 was the fact that I went blonde. I actually did something I said I was never going to do and persons thought that it was out of character for me because they always see my hair black and they this and that but if you thought you knew me you have no idea. The fourth thing, the fourth high for 2015 was the fact that my students in my speech club are excelling, they are improving in their speech. And of course, we regained our first place in the fourth annual Parkinson's disease speech competition. We were the winners. And of course, some of them are also student leaders in the school, maybe head boy, head girl, or deputy head boy. So they're doing very, very well. And that's a major high for me also. And the last thing, the last high for 2015 was the fact that I am actually beginning to live the dream of becoming an international speaker. In September 2015, I went to Farage Primary. And October 2015, I went to TG Global in terms of promoting literacy and encouraging students to read. That was really really good. I'm living the dream of spreading the word or spreading inspirational messages and through public speaking. And I really don't have much lows because I try to see things or life as a glass being half full as to half empty. So the only thing I can say could be classified as a low is crime. In the Bahamas, it went up, it increased and it, it was out of control. But of course, we're gonna stay positive for 2016 in hopes that there will be solutions to decrease crime. Now, my goal for 2016, my first goal is of course, to pursue a different or higher degree. And just stay tuned for that, more information in a minute. My second goal is to begin writing my fourth book. And that's gonna be interesting also. My third goal, of course, is to become more closer to God, to be more spiritual, and I'll be uploading more spiritual videos on my channel for you, because I want to spread the word of God and the message of God to every single person so that they can become aware of God and they can be ready when God comes, because He is coming back. My fourth and final goal is to reach a thousand plus subscribers on my YouTube channel. And I know, with your help, I can definitely achieve those goals, especially the fourth goal. That's it for this video, guys. And I want you to comment down below and tell me your highs and your lows of 2015, and of course, your expectations and your goals of 2016. And I'll be sure to comment back, definitely. Now, let's be positive 
2016, okay? And of course, let's always be unique. Thanks for watching. And the new year, shout it out loud. Sing with the crowd, celebrate cause good things are coming. New opportunities are out.